Are you guys like us and wondered what the heck a Copa Camaro is? Keep watching and we'll hopefully explain that for you. Hi, I'm Don and this is Double D Diecast, your YouTube home for everything Hot Wheels and more. If you like the videos, please hit like, leave a comment and if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button for your chance to win a bunch of Hot Wheels at the end of the year. In 1967, the Chevy Camaro was released by GM. GM limited the engine size for the Camaro to not exceed 400 cubic inches or 6.6 6 liters. So the biggest factory Camaro engine was the 396 cubic inch or the 6.5 liter V8. The bigger 4 to 7 cubic inch or 7 liter V8 was only available in the Corvettes. Chevy dealers and specific Don Yanko saw an opportunity here. To get the Camaros to compete with the Mustangs and the Barracudas, Yenko and other dealers leveraged the central office production order system, also known as the COPO. Yenko ordered his 1967 and 68 Camaro SS models and then swapped out the engines with the 427s from the Corvettes. This was a huge success. The Yenko Super Camaro of 67 and 68 also became known as the COPO Camaro. And in 1969, GM officially launched the COPO Camaro so it could race under the Chevy name. It was only produced by Chevy for uh, 1969 and then discontinued until 2012. To tie in with its 1969 heritage, only 69 are made each year. For 2018, GM and Hot Wheels partnered up together to celebrate Hot Wheels 50th anniversary, giving us the 2018 Copo Camaro. Was released in a crush orange color and you could also get it in a very cool blue one you should look out for in the hot wheels range later on this year and then there was also the very controversial ecopo a fully electric drag racing car Thanks for watching guys, uh, please let me know if I missed anything in the comments and also if there are any other castings that you'd like me to feature in a video like this, please let me know in the comments as well.